I am indeed alien, and this has been a successful water hole for us. Um, we just had another elephant walk past quickly, join the others. And we'll show him to you shortly. We might still get a view of him, but there goes a monitor lizard, a water monitor. Beautiful colors that almost black and yellow and a bit of green in there. Look at that. See, it just shows you with the warm afternoon that we're having today, a lot of these other animals are a bit more active especially some of these reptiles. Look at the sharp claws on that monitor. There it goes. It's quite close. Now they get much larger than this. Um, I'll, once he walks past, I'll show you how big he is and how big they can get. And give you an idea of the proportion. See that tongue darting in and out of the mouth, and that's tasting the air. That's how the monitors they use their sense of smell, like other reptiles. Use their tongue to taste the air. It's amazing to watch. Isn't that incredible? That one looks like it's got quite a quite a big belly and it's just decided to lay down there. Now the other monitor species we get here is the rock monitor. Now the rock monitor is a little bit thicker in body and um, the head's a little bit sh shorter than that with a much thicker head compared to this water monitor. They both get very very large Andy, no, these monitor lizards are not venomous. They give you a nasty bite. They've got very powerful jaws. They'll give you a nasty bite, but they're not venomous at all. So they're harmless to us. Um, but they would give you a, quite, a, quite a bad bite if you had to try and pick one up. Otherwise, generally, they just run away from you. But not venomous at all. Not like Komodo dragons. Komodo dragons have bacteria and enzymes, which actually creates them or creates a bit of venom. Now these monitor lizards don't have that. I'm sure they would have bacteria in their mouth too that you would have to get cleaned, but, but not nearly as bad as a Komodo dragon. We don't have Komodo dragons here, none in Africa. Now, Roshni, the main diet of monitor lizards, well, these water monitors would be moving around looking for chicks or birds, eggs. They'll be raiding nests. That's generally what they feed on. They'll also feed on other reptiles, um, birds, oh, as I said, birds and, and eggs. That's mainly what they feed on, though, especially these water monitors. Well, that elephant I was speaking of disappeared into the bush, but he just followed the line that those others m went in earlier. They, he followed straight behind them, moved off into the thicket. But there's a lot going on now. There's a lot of interaction with those in Yala that we showed you earlier. Oh, my goodness. Seems like the gremlins have found um, <laughs> poor Byron all the way in Chitwin.